Hey guys, it's me. So I just wanted to come on here real quick to do a small haul. It's super late at night and I was going to wait until later on to do this, but I just want to get it over with so I can put everything away and use it and whatever. So, um, I don't, if you watch my vlogs and stuff, like, I went to Torrid, I ordered some stuff from Torrid, and then I went to Torrid, and I didn't buy anything, so I'm just going to show you the things that I got online. The first thing is the shirt that I have on, but I did do an outfit of the day in this, so I will link it below if you want to see that. Um, so yeah, it's just this, like, gray sweatshirt material, um... It's so comfortable, and it is in a, ooh, sorry, um, it is in a size 5. Um, so the next thing I got, I hope you guys can see everything, and I'm in a frame, I'm using my phone, so, I don't know, is this shirt, um, it's like 3 quarter length sleeve, well, it's actually past 3 quarters, but, um, yeah, these are honestly, like, my favorite kind of shirts from Torrid. They're so comfortable. I love the length of the sleeves. I like that the sleeves on this are black because I have really big arms, so it's kind of, like, more thinning. And it's just, I haven't worn it yet, but I tried it on, and it was super comfortable. And this is in a size 5, of course, and it's $38.50. And then the last thing I have to show you is this, like, sweatshirt. It's like a sweatshirt, but it's really cute. So it just looks like this. Um, it says, shine on. And it has the, like, sequins on the shoulder. I don't know how well this is going to wash, but I thought it was really cute. And I did try it on, and it's, like, you know, comfortable and, like, soft. So, yeah, this is in a size 5, and it was forty-four fifty. So, I also ordered um, a shirt. I think it's long-sleeved. It was black and white striped, and it had, like, um, black patches on the sh um, shoulders, but I returned that today when I went because I just didn't think it was flattering on me. I think I was just too big for it. I didn't like the band on the bottom. Um, but I got all four of those shirts. The three that I just showed you and then the black and white one. Um, and shipping for $100. I use a... I don't remember what coupon it was, but I used a coupon... On everything and so all of that with tax and everything it came to a hundred dollars which is why I went to Torrid today because it earned me fifty dollars in haunt cash and I drove all the way to Torrid and didn't buy one thing <laughs> so that kind of sucked so that's all I got for from Torrid um, the next thing I went to Lush and I already knew exactly what I was gonna get I got um the ultra Bland, and this is like um, makeup remover. It says facial cleanser, but I use it to remove my makeup, and that's what they told me at the store. But yeah, so I don't really know what to say about this because I've talked about it so much. It doesn't really have like a good or bad smell, but it looks like this. It's hella expensive. I forgot how much it was the first time I bought it, and I went back, and, um, it's $30, and it's pretty small, but I loved it when I had it, so, since I didn't buy anything at Torrid, I thought I would spend $30 and get this. And then I also got the Popcorn Lip Scrub. I have super dry lips, and they're always, like, chapped looking, so, I, I don't know. I've heard a lot about this, so I just decided to go ahead and get it. I've never, 
I've never tried it before. So hopefully it works good. This was $10. So, yeah. I got these two little things for 40 bucks. But Lush is expensive. I smelled, like, tons of, like, bath bombs and stuff, and they smelled amazing, but I just couldn't spend $7 on one bath bomb. Maybe if I had a lot more money, I would, but no. So the next place that I went was um, Ulta, and I didn't know what to buy in there. Like, I had a bunch of different things on my mind, and I didn't know, and... I felt kind of guilty for even shopping today in the first place because I have other things that I should be doing with my money, but I seen this and I picked it up, but it's not for me. I actually got this for my mom for Christmas. It's the Lorac the Royal Pro Eye Collection. Um, if you guys have watched me for a while, I think like for my mom's birthday or something, I showed you guys, I got her like a little kit kind of like this. She really likes the Lorac eyeliner, and um, she's not like a high-end makeup person or anything, but I had got it for her, what was it? Oh, I got her the Lorac Pro Palette for Christmas last year, and the eyeliner came with it, and she really liked it. So, um, yeah, the eyeliner's $23, and this whole kit was $28, so I thought I would go ahead and get her that for Christmas. It's pretty. And I even swatched the eyeshadows and they're actually really pretty. And then I only got two more things. I um, have been wanting some new mascaras. I actually have a ton of mascaras. Like, I have the Lorac one. I have the Too Faced one. I have the Urban Decay. I just don't really like any of them. I don't know why, but I just don't like them. And I just keep using my three dollar Jordana mascara but I wanted to try something different so I went ahead and got the L'Oreal mango one I've heard a lot of people say that they like this so I really wanted to try it and then L'Oreal was buy one get one half off so I got the voluminous butterfly intensa oh so this is like the new one um I really like the original one, so I thought I would try this one. And I might actually do, like, a first impression on this one and do, like, a video on it, but I'm not for sure. So, that was all I got from Ulta. Keep in mind, I was kind of on a, a budget a little bit. Um, the one thing I do want to say is I did, when I went to Ulta, they did have the Tarte blushes, that were like the little ones and there was four of them and it was $35. It was like the holiday collection. And now that I'm not there, I, I don't know. I kind of wish I would have bought it because they were like so cute. Like these little like tart blushes like this and they were just so cute. And then I would have got a free um, tart maracuja oil, like the deluxe one and I love that stuff so... I should have got it, but I didn't. Um, but one last thing, I did go to Trader Joe's, and um, this is like my favorite wine, so I did want to show you guys. Um, I, I'm not even going to try to like pronounce it or anything, but I think this is my favorite wine I've probably ever had. It's so good. Um, it's like eight ninety nine. We don't have a Trader Joe's, so I made sure that since I was near one that I went and I got two bottles of my favorite wine. It's the Moscato, but I don't know how to say it. So, yeah. Um, that was my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed everything. Um, please thumbs up if you do like these videos, even if they're not like a ton of stuff. And, yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and if you guys have any um, questions or comments, feel free to leave them below.